Hello everyone, my name is Nicolas Loiseau. I'm a PhD student from France at the Creatis Laboratory in Lyon and Pascal Institute from Clermont-Ferrand. I will present my research with this presentation entitled Learning 3D Medical Images Patch Descriptors with the Triplet Loss. As you know, there is more and more medical images stored in packs but these images are not specially coherent as you can see in this uh, image many cranial scanners are located above body scanners and one goal is to register these images in coherent bases as you can see in this image the final goal is to register these images with deformable transformation here you can see many images registered in the common space. Uh, now to register these images we focus on parsimonious registration which need key points with good correspondences. In this image you can see key point detected in 2D medical images but there is some mismatch key point like 6 year or 6 year and uh, in this image the circle size corresponds to the scale of the key point. Many encrafted approach already exist to detect and describe key points like SIFs or surf 3 And in this work, we propose to use learning approach to improve performance in the description step. In this first step, we use 3D surf detector to detect key points. Some algorithm al already exist to learn descriptor in 2D and here we will extend triplet loss learning in 3D. In this image you can see a shallow network uh, with the input patch here in 3D, two convolutional uh, la uh, layers and a fully connected layers which gives um, the size of the description vector. In this image you can see the expected results after learning with the triplet loss. The network tends to create cluster of similar key point descriptor. This is uh, uh, an example in two dimensions, but our descriptors size have more more dimension. The triplet loss now um, the his uh, learning aim to bring similar key points closer together in the description space and to move away the non-matching key points. The triplet model take three patches as input, one anchor, one positive and one negative. The anchor and the positive are two patches corresponding to the same physically detected key point in two different images, while the negative uh, patch is a different point. The goal of the triplet loss is therefore to, to make that two patches corresponding to the same key point are closer in the description space and that two different patches uh, are far away. We can see the expected result here. After learning, the network pushes the negative to be further away inside the anchor than the positive. Uh, with the triplet loss, we need to add a process so that the network learns correctly and quickly. The triplet mining. It is a process that is based on the distance between descriptors in order to find the most informative triplets to learn during each uh, iteration. Now for training, we need data with exact correspondences between key points, but there is no data sets like that in 3D, so we need to generate a semi-synthetic data set. First of all, for the data at my disposal, I have the visceral database with a gold group which contain 20 images with 40 landmarks per image and the second group named silver with 60 images without landmark. We use the landmark for the, from the gold group to estimate transformation between patients and apply random, transfer, random affine transformation to original patient. We can then extract the key point from all these patients with sort 3D. Then we will transform the key point extracted from transfer patient to the original patient. Uh, 
and keep only the key point detected several times and then extract patches around the surviving key points. With this method we can keep around 20,000 key points per patient and make around 2 million triplets per training epoch. For the result, we compare our solves method to the descriptor of surf 3 d on two dif different metrics. The first one is the false positive rate at uh, 0 0.95 of true positive recall, FPR 95, with a low FPR 95 indicate good results. And the second uh, metric is the average distance between landmarks after a registration in a common space. As you can see on this table, we are better in terms of uh, mean distance between landmark and 10 times better in terms of FPR95. On this image, we can see the training and the testing of curves according to the epoch. To conclude, we introduce a new learning approach for 3D descriptors in medical images with a fast execution and good results compared to handcrafted method. Regarding future work, for description we would like to test applying deformable than rather than uh, affine transformation when generating data for training and the big question of uh, intermodality de description uh, with some possible idea of uh, network a network per modality or a GAN to generate MRI, for example. And this workshop uh, shows the possibility of improving description with a learning approach, but results do not significantly improve the results of the final registration, and to improve it, the detection step is really important. Thank you for your attention.